Now that you have a form you like for volunteers to complete, uh, this uh, video is going to talk through how do you actually post it as an iframe tag. And this is relying on the information that was shared as part of the setup and configure. Uh, this is as of July 2017, so it, it's probably changed, so you may want to get an update. Um, but specifically, what they do is they share two different frames, uh, one being HTTP, the other one HTTPS. Uh, and you can kind of work with your, your site folks on how best to make that happen. But, but copying kind of this information, and again, going back to the, the site details, this is the information that I'm pulling from, and then also using kind of this site. And so what I did was to say, let's, uh, in, in WordPress, what I, what I did was to, to add a new page, uh, called it Volunteers Reg Form. Uh, this creates an address, or you can can edit the uh, the web page. Uh, and what I did was I posted in the information. The, uh, the the this is the a direct copy from that uh, uh, PDF. What you'll see though is is that it creates two sets of quotation marks. Uh, and so what I ended up doing was having to the second version here is is editing off the curly ones, the inside ones, and leaving just the outside ones. And so when you this is entering as text. When you enter it as, as, as a visual, this is what you end up getting. So with the top one, you're, you're, it's trying, uh, but it's not actually able to, to get what it needs. Um, the second one, we do get a full form, and it's, it's working well. So needless to say, what I have to do now is just publish this form, use this link in anything that I'd share or in any pages that reference it, and I'm able to work specifically with, uh, with forms. Good, good luck to you.